Why, hello there. Since the last video, I've been working on the farm. And this is now what I have. We have uh, the area fenced in with a gate to provide protection at night when I want to mess around in here at night. And the little minions working away. Look at them go. Some of them are upgraded. I mean, they're all upgraded, but some of them are upgraded more. Then on the other side of the farm, we have this area where I plan on building a little cottage, a little grain silo. So that's some of what I've been working on. Rather than buying my dirt, I've been getting it through the trade menu here. I didn't know about the trade menu before, so that's a uh, pretty handy. And I have an idea for how I want to enclose this area, what sort of fence I want to build for this area, if my idea will work. So let's give that a try. I put the crafting bench over here instead of over there, so that way I could access it at night without running into the baddies that keep coming in. So here's what I want to do to make things a little more artistic. I would like to do a, a fence thing. I don't know if this idea is going to work. What I was hoping to do was I was hoping to put these uh, back to back. You know, like... Well, not like that, but you get the idea. I was hoping to put them back to back. Although this, this design here, if I could keep it going, would make sort of an interesting fence shape. So it looks like if we put one down when we're facing forward and then put the next one down facing to the side like this, it'll give this uh, interesting sort of effect, which is really just as good as what I had in mind of having it all back to back. I mean, I kind of like that. How about you? Now, can we do the corner? Will the corner work? There, I cleaned it up a little bit. I saw the count was a little off, so that should clean it up. It's one forward and one to the side. Repeating is how you get these two nubbies and the space. So now what should we put on the end here to sort of cap it off? Just a block? Yeah, that looks good. Now we'll do the same for the other side. I think we're going to have to extend the dirt area by one. Otherwise, we're going to get this effect in the corner instead of this effect here. I think maybe the reason I can't get this corner to work how I want it is maybe uh, this block isn't placed properly to give us the nub and a space we need. Oh, now it wants to place back to back. I think I might have to go with a different design on the corners because we're supposed to have a nub on each side of the block here or a space on each side of the block. So there's a space here and there should be a space here. But when I try to redo it, it just keeps doing this thing where it starts making the block turn in a funny direction. And if I do it this way, put a block there. Okay, that time it worked. But now, there are too many blocks without a space. Or if I do it going from the end, there are still too many blocks without a space. So, I think I'm going to have to reimagine a little bit how this whole thing works. This was the original demarcation line. Uh, 
Uh, I don't know. Well, I'll have to spend some time figuring this one out later, but this is the basic idea of the fence, the type of, of cobblestone fence thing I want to create here. And then put a little cottage in here, and like I said, a, a grain silo of some sort off to the side. That's what the stone is for. And uh, then we just keep on expanding our island. Like if you did, subscribe is good.